playing with art show. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how I made my cardboard desk. I made this a few years ago. I've modified it once, and then I've recently actually repainted it, which I'll show you in the next video. But in today's video, I'm just going to show you how I originally built it. A few years ago, I needed a desk, and I wanted something that was lightweight and something that I could easily take apart so I could open up my space to work on other projects. So I decided to build something myself out of cardboard. This picture shows the original version. And then later I shortened the width and cut a notch into it to put the keyboard at a more ergonomic level. For the desktop, I bought a series of the same size boxes that were four and a half inches high and arranged them into the size that I wanted the final desk to be. I offset every other row and then cut some of the boxes in half to make sure that none of the seams were in the same place. Before sealing the boxes shut, I threaded through two shower curtain rods to give it more of a structural stability. I bolted the boxes together using metal paper fasteners and then sealed the boxes and bound them together using heavy duty shipping tape. The legs were made out of cut down cardboard boxes. The larger one was a wardrobe box I found in the recycle bin. The other two I purchased whole. All surfaces were covered with pieces of paper grocery bag that I affixed with a combination of white glue and a little bit of water. And then after dry, the whole thing was sealed with a mixture of clear acrylic, burnt umber paint, and water. In the next video, I'll show you how I later, a few years after I built it, colorized it using some mixed media techniques.